I'll show you how to remove your blog post publication dates. So I'm here in Squarespace 7.1. I have a demo site set up for us with a blog. Let's go ahead and click on the blog. And there are actually two places you could see publication dates appearing. One is on the main blog page where all your posts live. And this could look a little different depending on the layout you've chosen. And the other is if we click into a post, there's also the date here. So let's go back to our blog page and remove that date first. So what we want to do is we want to click edit and then roll over, click the pencil icon and scroll down until we get to meta. And here you'll see we have primary meta content categories. I don't have any of those, but I can set it to none or I can make it the author if I wanted, but I'm going to change it to none and secondary meta content. We'll change that to none as well. So now we just have our blog post title and excerpt and the read more link. You can certainly um, show or hide the read more link, show or hide the excerpt. So if you want it to be super clean, you can do a look like this. When you're finished with that, go ahead and click save. Now we still need to remove the dates on the individual posts themselves. So to do that, you click on any post and it will apply the settings to all the posts in that blog. So first we'll click edit once we're inside the blog post area, then roll over to the pencil icon, click it and scroll down just a little bit until you see show categories, turn that off, turn off date. We can also turn off author name, author profile. If I had categories set up and I wanted to show those, I'd add it back, but I don't have any here. And you can play around with, if you had some things, you can also change the spacing, the delimiter style between them. So from bullet to pipe or dash or just a space, but I'm going to turn these off. So I don't need that. Once you have it looking like you want, go ahead and go to done and save. There you have it. No more publication dates on your blog or your blog posts. Hope this was helpful. Best of luck with your website.